taking a look at the tail of the tape here. Kelvin Tiller talked about the weight. Last season, he was cutting 20 plus pounds. He came in on weight this year. He looks visibly leaner. He looks in better shape. Muhammad Darius, he's about where he was a year ago, about 240, 242 pounds he weighed in officially. How do you become a mama's boy that when that's your mama? That's Patricia Raines. Kelvin Tiller's mother drives all over the country to support her son, his number one fan. Lillian Garcia will get these heavyweights started in a feature bout in the PFL Smart Cage. The Professional Fighters League continues with three rounds of action in the heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He is a wrestler, standing at six feet even, weighing in at 242 pounds. He has an undefeated professional record of 7-0, with four of those wins coming by knockout. Fighting out of Titusville, Florida, here is Mo Muscle Mohamed Dari. His opponent, fighting out of the red corner, he is Boxer, also standing at six feet tall, weighing in at 263 pounds. In 12 professional bouts, he has an impressive record of 10 victories and two defeats. Fighting out of Topeka, Kansas, here is Mama's boy, Kelvin Tiller. Your referee in charge, Todd Anderson. Todd Anderson will keep it clean in this featured heavyweight bout. Kelvin Tiller, the mama's boy in the silver trunks. Mo Muscle, Muhammad Darius in the blue. Here we go, gentlemen. Ready? Ready? Hey! Touch of the gloves to start thing off. And an inside leg kick from Muhammad Darius. It's been very in style tonight, Randy. Yeah, everybody's been using that. The last two shows, we saw a lot more calf kicks than we saw the, the inside kick. But tonight, we've been seeing all kinds of inside kicks. Flicking the jab out is Muhammad Darius, light on his feet. Calvin Tiller content to take the center of the cage and stalk his opponent on the outside. A couple of body shots for Darius. Tiller said he changed his diet, changed his training. He's in much better shape, and he's a pressure fighter. So you're going to see him come forward as much as he can. Nice jab there from Darius. Leg kick. Muhammad Darius on his bike, Eve, moving back and forth on the outside of that cage. Yeah, he's keeping that mo motion lateral also. He's moving left to right, getting out of the way, not letting Kelvin Tiller put his back on the fence. But in this tie-up, he just showed us some strength by spinning Tiller around and putting Tiller's back on the fence. He gives nice. up about 20 pounds to Tiller, so not easy to do that. Darius with a nice bob and weave, but comes right up into, into one of Tiller's shots. Therese working the knees against the cage here. While Therese's well, left hand, his left elbow is so low, Tiller should punch that arm inside. Not anymore. Therese does a great job of dumping Tiller over his legs. Nice trip. Now lands here in the half guard for Kelvin Tiller, who reaches for that Kimura isolation from the bottom. He's trying to, he's got it wrapped up. He's trying to pull it out. Mohamed Dariz has that arm hit. Oh, it's out. He's got it out. This is bad. Mo Muscle in Mo trouble Muscle's here. Have to roll. He's got to clear that right leg. Mo Muscle's got to clear that right leg and roll to relieve this pressure on his shoulder. Oh, he's in deep trouble here. Kelvin Tiller cranking Tiller, Tiller on the arm. Nice 
good bite on that leg now. Mo Muscle not willing to tap, and that arm is bending like crazy. This is deep. Oh, he's, he's almost out. Delicious. Let him go. There he's out. Oh, he's out. But he's good. He's got to use it to sweep, though. He's going to roll with it. He's got to go all the way over. And it's oh, on. Now he's on top. It's still on. He's waiting, he's, waiting he's, waiting he's, waiting he's waiting to tap. The ref is on the wrong side. He can't see that arm. Repositioning needs... himself as the referee. Uh, there's the tap. There's the tap. There's the tap. There's the tap. There's there's the tap. tap. Oh my gosh. Submission victory. Nasty Kimura for Kelvin Tiller. Good for six points. And Mama Patricia Reigns likes what she sees. That was tenacious. He was on that. Like a rat on a cheetah, he was not letting that go. The Mama's boy showing off the submission skills again here in season two. The Mama's showing off the dance skills. <laughs> That Kimura looked painful. I love you, Kansas City. Yeah, Tell you what, give credit to Muhammad Dariz. He fought it as long as he could. He went for the, he got his leg out. He, went, he rolled all the way over. Then he found himself on bottom. Another roll. And goodness gracious, Kelvin Tiller. Cranking on that arm the whole time. Yeah, he, Kelvin Tiller has the arm cranked right here. Muhammad Dariz knows he has to clear that right leg to relieve that pressure. He's pushing down on Tiller's leg, trying to extract his right leg so that he can roll. And when he finally does get it out, Tiller uses that to tip him over and get on top and follow him and keep cranking that Kimura, pushing that, that wrist behind the head. And here it comes. He's cranking. Mohamed Dariz tries to relieve the pressure. Tiller just follows him to the top, traps his head between his legs, and then Tiller steps over himself. Because Dereese is a pretty strong man, and when Tiller steps that right leg over, it's just too much. It's, it's Tiller's entire body against Dereese's left arm, and there's nobody strong enough to defend against that. Tell you what, a lot of times when you see guys roll out of something, there's a readjustment of the grip on that Kimura from the top man. None of that from Kelvin Tiller. He hung on. What I don't like is the referee's position. The referee can't see that tap, and as Muhammad Dereese is tapping, the referee doesn't see it. He's tapping now. He's tapping. He's tapping. It. Ooh, that. I tell you what, Kelvin Tiller let go of that because he felt the definitive tap. It wasn't the referee that broke that one up. Credit yeah. to Kelvin Tiller. Good sportsmanship there, Absolutely. knowing the situation he was in. Hopefully, Muhammad Darius suffered no injury there. Here's Patricia Reigns, the mama, to Kelvin Tiller's mama's boy. Loves what she sees. Six points in the heavyweight standings for her son. He made that old go. Well, we talked about that pre-fight, right? Kelvin Tiller said, you gotta, sometimes you gotta be the one that teaches people how to lose. He was taught <laughs> earlier in his career. He passed that lesson on to Muhammad Darius. And Darius was very active in the striking. He was on the bike, he was moving around. He actually took Kelvin Tiller down and it proved to be his demise. Tiller showed his entire game last season. He brought it again this season, showing us his grappling game. Lillian Garcia makes it official inside of our PFL game. Ladies and gentlemen, the stoppage comes officially at 3 minutes and 22 seconds into round number one. Submission by Kamura, earning six points in the heavyweight division. Mama Six points for Kelvin Tiller out of Topeka, Kansas. Where does that put him in the heavyweight standings? Well, Dennis Goldsup got the finish just a little bit quicker, so he'll remain atop the heavyweight bracket. Kelvin Tiller comes in with six points just underneath. Ante Delia, Ali Isayev, Francie Marvajoso, Satoshi Ishii, all with hard-fought decision victories. Each of those good enough for three points. And Caroline's inside the cage with the whole family. I am indeed Sean, Patricia Rain, the mama of the mama's boy, Kevin Tiller. Look, 
huge congratulations. You've been working on your athleticism. It showed up. Talk us through that Kimura. You were not letting go. Uh, before I say that, uh, I want to let you, the fans know that I absolutely love you guys. I want to let you, uh, my kids know I absolutely love y'all. A month ago, I got hit in my eye, and I swear my orbital bone was broken. I didn't tell nobody. I couldn't train uh, literally for almost a month. Uh, I could barely hit mitts. I had the worst headaches. It, it, it was the worst. But I, I swear I thought about y'all. I thought about my kids. And I still came out here, and I still performed. Uh, uh, so thank you. Thank you for pushing me. I love you guys. And uh, to answer your question, uh, I watched his fights. He's, uh, he's aggressive for the takedown, but he, uh, he, 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 he doesn't, he don't, he don't got really good jujitsu. Um, he gets lazy on the ground. Uh, I think he's a great guy. I think he's a, a future champion, but it's just my time. I told you I'm on a different level. This is what I do. I was talking to him the whole entire time. I love this. I, I, I love it I, I, so much, you know? So thank y'all so much. <laughs> Such great energy, and Patricia, I want to talk to you. You don't like him going to the ground. You're like, always oh, stay on his, on his feet, but he's got his most wins are by submission. Well, let me tell you, I was raised in the ghetto, so when you see people on the ground in the ghetto in a fight, you get to see them people get kicked and beat, so that's what comes to my mind when he's on the ground. Not this regulated stuff, so. So more confidence with him now? I always have the confidence. I don't care on the ground. how good he gets. I'm going to never like him on the ground. Oh, well, that's a mum's opinion. And you've got every right to that. So we're excited to see what you do next. Congratulations tonight. This is your night. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Thank you, fans. I love you guys! Woo! Calvin Taylor, everybody. And mama. This way. This way. Yeah. Get ready. Uh-huh. Listen. What you want to do? If you don't strike first, that's when they gon' come at you. Yeah. And you know it's true. Don't let your life get worse. Being timid, that ain't cool. Nah. No. 